Hello again, folks, and welcome back to Let's Play Deception 4 Nightmare Princess. I'm your host, the Game Darius. As we left off, Zeno had sent a freaking huge ass army of people to try to kill me, but failed because Zeno. And now we're on to actually face off against him. This may be annoying. <laughs> Well, first we gotta definitely deal with this healer type, because I'd much rather not deal with the healer types. Aw, oh, you just sound so dainty, and I'm gonna be sorry about killing you, unless you hit me. Alright, now that you've taken a moment to pause yourself, let's see, I want to focus on the healer first. Because it almost sounds like the night lady is going to run the frick away if I do anything terrible to her. Which really she should. I'm just saying. Super Saiyan. So will that actually work knocking them into the thing? If there is a thing in fact to knock her into. Oh, and there's the Magnus, Magnus guy who's here too. And strip punch! Well, I know that that was... <laughs> oh, God damn it. I know that that was not, in fact, Healer Lady, but... I mean, she was right there. Oh god, I love that punch. Okay. Back to what we were doing. Um, Healer lady needs to die first. Somewhere else, because I can never... Whoa, hello. Because I can never get this chamber right. Anything that has to do with timing, I am just forever boned. I'm just saying. Oh, they're all here. I wonder if I could... Square this away? Maybe not. Also, this music is chaotic as balls. I don't know if anyone else is listening to this, but... You know... Ooh. Would that work? Alright. Freeze, ladies! I... I don't know who was hit that time, but I'm sorry. Not really. Ooh, c c combo She actually landed. Oh no! Damn it! I thought she had actually gotten into the thing. All right. There. God, this music. It reminds me of, um, powerhouse music, you know. Da 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 Yeah, that one. I would much prefer that Little Miss Healer comes first. Ladies first, after all. But I guess it's gonna be Mr. Magnus first. Ooh. I'm not sure what just happened there. Alright, uh, spiked bowl. That'll lead him all the way down. So, evil smash. Evil gets smashed. No, 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 no. I want to make sure that they're in position long enough so acid's slime first. Ladies. Whoa, hello. Alright, come on. Myself on that one. Wait, what? Why'd you end up down there? Okay. Now it's just a question of which square should I put it in? Put it in this one. I guess I'm moving my evil smash. Kind of a. I don't know how to word it. Kind of a misrepresentation of such a name, isn't it? 
called Evil Smash. But the only person that really gets smashed in it is good guys. Well, I suppose some bad guys as well. Okay, and you're getting healed by the healer. A little too much for my liking. There we go. Oh crap. Whoop. And then she's gonna get the evil smashed out of her. Or into her. Oh! I mean, I was hoping that I was gonna hit the healer, but okay. Ooh. That sounded painful. And Michelle is still healing. Damn it. Okay. Need to focus on that healer. I need to do it in one fell swoop. And that's the hard part. Evil Smash does a lot of damage, but not enough. So what I want... is pain. So if we Rocket Horse her... down there... Hit her with a killer top. I don't fully know what the killer top does, but it does a thing. Then lethal lance. Then spike ball. And maiden's embrace. I can't maiden's embrace. I am out of traps. I mean, unless I want to get really creative and, like, slap one more trap just beforehand. Yeah, let's try that. Let's try her slapping one more trap right here. Alright, she's gonna heal herself. Gonna kindly ask people to chill out. Yes. Yes! was not my intention, but okay. Alright. Ah, oh, so close. Come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. Ian's dead. What have I done? Means Zeno's gonna appear now, ain't he? And then my life will be a living hell. All right. No, no, it's cool. It's cool, Miss Healer. Miss Healer. Don't, don't make me. Have to... Okay. Come on. Do a thing, guy. I hate you both. I really do. I despise you both. Oh, they must both have like a high... Kuzuma does it. Yeah, they must. Okay, so those are no longer bunk. So let's make it humiliating then instead. If they insist on it after all. Uh, actually... If I rocket horse someone down there, that would be ineffectual and pointless. See, what I need is just one more wall, or one more brutal trap, and I could finish the... What's the word for it? When you have, like... Ah, oh, I'm out of frost waves, too. Okay, no. Good. 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 Excellent. Yeah. <laughs> Good. Awesome. Fantastic. This is 
doing just as planned. Maybe a little bit better. Awesome. That worked. Can't believe that worked. Yeah, I'm just hoping it's not Zeno. No one will let me live up if it's Zeno. <sighs> and then there was you. God, he's resistant against everything. Maybe I should break his armor first. Seems like a smart idea. First, I gotta deal with this mage bastard. Ah, dang it. Fine, running away for now. Wait, unless I can catch them within the horse. Come on. Oh crap, what is that move? What was that move? Zeno, ow, friendo. What was that move? Okay, I guess Frindo is a little bit strong of a word to use against him while with him. Ah, uh, goddammit. <sighs> yep, I'm not gonna hate this stage at all. Cause Zeno isn't a fun fight or anything. Alright, I guess I gotta run to the stage. Hope that I get to... Uh... I can delay him some, right? Like if I just evil smash him right here. Yeah, that should be plausible. And I don't know. Rocket horse. Spike ball. I'm wondering how much bullshit the game will actually do to make it so as you know, it's a pain in the ass. And I know I'm risking not getting healing. Oh, you son of a bitch. No, no, that's fine. That's cool. That's all right. It's not like he was perfectly within view or anything. Maybe I should just go full cheese. You guys know what I'm talking about. Freaking use the toilet. He's resistant against it. Okay. Toilet? No, that's rake. Blech. Toilet. There. I don't know. Freaking Delta Horse make it really humiliating. As he's getting off his high horse. And smash him. And can I make him some brace over here? Just barely not. I can't do anything right there, because of the walls, huh? Hatred. Wait, if I punch him, that's just going to activate the thing, and he won't get caught. All right, so, different plan? Yeah, that'll fuck, that's fine. All right, oh crap. Yep, mm, hi. Would you kindly stop being the punch? Happy prick. Well, I deal with your friend. I call shenanigans on that not working. But you know what? As long as part of it works. All right, that's his friend dead. Ooh. Is he not dead? He's not dead. Damn it. Alright, now I definitely gotta get some healing at the stage. Where the frick's the stage again? Stage is this way, right? Right. Yeah, event stage. <sighs> okay. I got this, though. I got this. It's only... 
most annoying character that I've faced in this entire game so far. <laughs> what you guys are talking about? Alright. Put him there. Put him on his high horse. Uh, punch him clear across the arena. Put him on the bidet. Which will push him there. And then when it gets onto the said bidet, rock your horse. It's an older combo, but it checks out. Especially if it works. Really, I just want to kill Magnus. Magnus? What kind of a name's Magnus for a mage that's based around doing the frosty stuff? I don't know. Ah, uh, hi! No, 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 no. Ah. Fine, get on your high horse, you goddamn pallet prick. Right, it was this stage that that thing exists, not the other one. Acid slime, forgot about acid slime. I need to remove his armor. Do I? I don't think I need to. It would be nice. Okay. Quick. Quick change in plans. He's gonna be up there for a second. So I'll roll him down here. Oh no, whatever shall I do? The great and mighty Xeno is kicking my ass legitimately. Ooh. Like your armor there, Xeno. Well, I don't. Where's Magnus gone? See? So low in health that he decided to run away? I kind of hope so. Alright, let's remove the spike ball. Acid slime would have been a good thing to make uh, full use of there, but eh. Alright. Zooms on back. All the way over here. Can I hit him with the... Yes, I can. Yeah, you okay down... Did that only remove part of his armor? That's a nuisance. Oh well, now he dies. Humiliatingly. Well, at least I killed him with a stage crab. Seriously, is that really what his broken armor is all supposed to be? Just broken? Nothing else? Like, not even his face revealed or anything? Just... It's broken? Alright. I guess I'll just finish off Bankness here. Enjoy the ride! I hate you. That was anticlimactic. Yes, no, just die already. Thank you. And of course, I ended it with cheese.逃げても逃げても
また引っ越すかよリリアここ気に入ってたのにな向かうのは例の場所です例の場所それって儀式の遺跡のことそうですということはそろそろ仕上げにええ頃合いでしょう我らが主の復活に向けて儀式の準備を行いますキュフン聖言はもはや集まる流れに入っているって踏んでいるわけねかつて聖言によって封印の儀式が行われた遺跡で待ち構え全てが集まったところですぐに封印解除の儀式を執り行いますじゃあ念のためそれなりの足跡もここに残しとかなきゃね姫様間もなくです我らの悲願成就まで間もなくですええお父様Well, I kind of flubbed on making a super combo for the last of those dudes, but hey, 8,000 world. Got a new missions have been added. Oh, goody. Then a seven hit combo, seven hit combo. Combo that uses six or more. Humiliated. I'm officially saying no more to those. To these. No. No. I know I could do them, but again, it would be one of those cases where each chapter would then be like four plus times of me failing. All right, let's let's unbind some Diabolica. Diabolicas aren't cheap. Suspended ceiling, large ceiling comes crashing down, crushing the hapless. I'm gonna say victim. Two stage attack. You know what? Screw it. It's like a pumpkin head, but more humiliating because it's a meme. Ha! Memes are funny, apparently. Wonder if I should go with hanging chains. I kind of just want to unlock everything. That's kind of the sad part. This just binds for six seconds. That's a pretty good length of time. Yes, let's let's do it. Let's do the humiliation. <laughs> All right, so pretty much I could just combo days for days, days for days. It's words I never thought I'd say. Ah, uh, damn it! I didn't realize that the flaming boulder was existent. You'll have to pardon me. It has actually been a couple of days since I had last recorded from before this ch last chapter. Because I dreaded fighting Zeno. Because fighting him was not fun when I first fought him. What made the game think that it was going to be fun facing off against him again? <sighs> Cake in the face. Yep, that's uh, that's a wall that's going to throw cake in someone's face. Probably should have gone with something smarter like a syringe. But now I've only got 10 wall, so... Let's change up the Diabolica. Uh, what does the cake of the face do exactly? I know. I know I should have actually looked into it. Cake is launched in the victim's face, rendering them unable to see. And it pushes them three squares. It's not, it's not bad. If it pushes them three squares from where they are, then that actually opens up quite a bit of movement that I could possibly do. Kind of like that. What was the other one? Ah, uh, yes, the horse head. <sighs> I mean, it's it's, it's a good uh, it's a good thing. Pushes eight squares. <sighs> Anyways, um, and then the. Um, uh, fountain toilet. They're both bidets. I just, nah. Let's 
let's get rid of the iron rake for the fountain toilet. Um, killer top was all right. I just thought it was gonna. Oh wait, that's right. Okay, so it'll do like enveloping damage when it lands on you, but it will push you three squares if you get shot into it. In which case, it's kind of lame. Because you guys know how the blasts worked in the previous games. It would probably work something like that. And that's just a little unruly for me. I'd rather it just, bam, one massive hit of damage and that's it. So in which case, I'd probably just go for the nasty needle. Yeah. So that's still four a piece. Is there anything else I need to? No. I think I'm good. I believe. No new abilities. No new co. Oh wait. I've had this equipped. It. I'm confused. Oh, whatever. Oh no. I'm in. Yeah. Here. Um, oh right, the last one was slow wave. Ah well. Nothing I was gonna particularly use. Uh, I guess this is an episode then. Quick look over these guys. Pedro, Mar Mauricio, Ingrid, Rifle Bearing Knight. Ah oh, god. Archer Knight, Sword Wielder. So I'm going to have to armor break all of these guys, aren't I? Armor break you. Don't have to armor break you. That's a relief. Armor break you. Um, you know it's better to aim with two eyes. Right, Ingrid? No? Alright. Uh, again, two eyes. Agnes, whatever. And Margaret. I don't know, I always loved the design of some of these guys' armors. I just wish they didn't, you know, suck sometimes. <laughs> I have captured barely anyone. God damn it. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and call an episode here. I feel like I'm stalling for time, which I'm not. I'm just unsure how to end this. Besides going into chapter 10. I am like two chapters until the end of the game. And then... I'm not planning on doing any of the, uh, excuse me, any of the other endings. It's just whatever ending I get, and that's it. So yeah, thank you all for watching, and I hope to see you guys in the next episode. Take care. Cheers.